Hey guys! Oh my goodness, it is September already. Time is flying by so fast. But the beginning of September, of course, means it's time for another Plan With Me video. So I'm kind of excited. Um, so I did get a new sticker set. It's actually an entire month spread, but I'm gonna just use it for one week. Um, so this uh, sticker set is actually on one sheet of paper and it comes from an Etsy store by the name of Crafted by Corley. And I will just link it down below if you know you're interested in in this set. But it's pretty nice. It has of course these turquoise blue color and then of course the purple color and gray, which I think is really pretty and it's kind of easing you into fall. That's exciting. The word fall excites me. But this set is really nice because it has all these heart check boxes with the to-do banner. And it also has the holidays that are in September. So you have Labor Day, Grandparents Day, and the first day of autumn. And then some other little rectangular boxes, weekend banners, and then full check boxes, little circles, which are absolutely adorable with this kind of chevron print. I really like that. And then these little bubbles right here for whatever reminders. And then of course the payday stickers and the utilities as well. So if you have any bills or anything that you need to pay, you can use these little icons. I'm probably going to do one Plan With Me video each month, probably the first week in every month. So if you love planner videos, um, just look out for those at the beginning of every month. I'm just going to jump right in right now and begin planning and I hope you enjoy it. Okay, so let's begin. I'm just going to remove my little reminders here and I'll just um, link the video that explains how I use my reminders and why I place them the way that I do. I forgot to mention in my intro that I'll also be using these washi tapes that I just picked up at Target. One is a silver glitter washi tape, one is a turquoise washi, and the other is purple and white in chevron. And I thought it matched my little kit perfectly, so that's why I picked these ones. That is my son making noise, and these are his little feet right here. So if you see something moving right here in his blanket, that's my son. I think he's trying to talk to you guys. So I'm going to begin with the turquoise washi, and I think I'm just going to start by sectioning the days off. So I'm just going to run a line of washi with each day. Yeah, I kind of like that look, so I'm just going to do that, and I'll probably fast forward it. And I think I'm going to just alternate. So one day we'll have the turquoise and then the next we'll have this pretty purple. So now that I've sectioned off each day, I'm going to take the silver sparkly washi and kind of just make a decorative area at the top right here just to make it a little bit more decorative a little bit more fun. I'm actually going to cover the word September um, because I have it on this side already so I'm just going to cover that with a little bit of silver washi and I think that looks kind of cute. Just something different that I'm trying out for the first time. Alright now that I've sectioned off my days and I've done something at the top, I don't know what that is. Actually I don't really know if I like it but it's down now so I'm going to have to work with it. Baby feet, haha. <laughs> I am going to go in with my to-do stickers from this kit and I'm going to place them right next to this box I believe. Yes, I'm going to place them right there like that. And I'm going to put one for every day. So I have Mondays, then Tuesdays, Wednesday, that's covering it, so I'll just cover that over. And Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. So I have my to-do boxes and then I'm going to go in with my favorite part, 
which is the weekend banner. And I'm just gonna kinda hang it. I don't know where to put, oh, this looks kinda cute. I think I'm gonna just do it at an angle, just to let me know that, hey, it's the weekend. That's cute. Now I'm gonna go in with my full boxes and kinda place them sporadically. Um, I think I'm gonna put this one right here like this because that's the ninth. That's my son's two month birthday or he's two months old, yes. So I'm gonna write that in right there. And then I'll just go in with these kind of boxes and just fill up the areas. And anything special that I have to write in, I think I'll put that there. Bless you, little boy. So I'm gonna put in this chevron box. And, ooh, this tree looks cute. I like this one. I'm just gonna, oh, what happened, little boy? I'm just gonna put the tree box in just on Tuesday and I'm just randomly doing this it's no rhyme or reason I think I'm kind of going with the decor as well um, this full purple box I want to put here I guess I don't know yeah that looks pretty good there and then I have a stripe box let's see where could it go that it makes sense and looks decent maybe here that looks kind of cute as my reminders what do you guys think? Oh, I wish you could tell me. I think I'm going to just put it right here and do my reminders like that because I think that it looks more balanced. Yeah, I'm going to go with that. <laughs> um, next, I'm going to put in my thankful thought. I've talked about these before. It is, um, I'll link it below where I got this one, but this one says, in the end, we regret the chances that we didn't take. I think that's an excellent quote. But the reason that I'm really picking it is because the color matches um, my kit so I'm just gonna put that right in the thankful thought area and then I'm going to start to go in and write the things that I'm doing for the week um, another thing that I haven't mentioned before is I got these little water stickers which I think are adorable um, it's pretty much a water bottle and then it has eight lines on it and for each eight ounce glass of water that you drink you kind of fill that little line in and it kind of tracks your water so it's a habit tracker and so I'm just gonna put these little water icons in because it is important that I track my water every day um, because I'm trying to you know have more water intake especially when you're uh, breastfeeding you need to drink a lot of water so I'm gonna put one of these little guys in for every day and just track the amount of water that I drink The next thing that I'm going to do is take these little bubbles, I guess they're called of some sort, they're just smaller little boxes, and I'm going to use this as my title or header for chores, and I'm going to just write chores um, right next to it, the chores that I need to do, probably using these three lines. The reason that I um, only give myself three chores a a day is because I feel like that's more realistic that's just you know what I find works for me and my family and I'm not gonna put a chore header for a Saturday because I give myself one day of kind of rest and break Oh, I don't want to put two chevrons on the same day. Okay, I'm going to lift this one up. Or I shouldn't say chevron, but two of that color. So I'm going to do the purple chevron for Sunday, and then the multicolor one for Friday. And I'm just going to reposition this so that it is straight. All right, so I have my little chore headers in. The next thing that I'm going to do is Sunday. Um, I'm gonna go in with these football stickers. I actually got them from Michaels. I think they are so cute. And I'm gonna put that down for Sunday because Sunday the 11th is the first day of NFL. I'm so excited. Um, my team actually doesn't play until Monday. I'm a big Pittsburgh Steelers fan, but um, I still wanna mark that, you know, it's the beginning of NFL Sunday. Woohoo, I'm 
I'm so excited. So I think I'm going to use, should I use game day or the big game? Well, I think the big game is more applicable for like Super Bowl. Yes, baby. Mommy's talking to the people about football. You know how much I love football. I think I'm going to use defense and offense because I think these are super cute. And put a little football down. And I don't know. I think I'm going to do game day. Because I think that's cute. Oh, no. No, it's in the way. Okay, I'll do game day here. And maybe offense like that. Oh, that's cute. Offense, defense, and then game day. I hope you guys can see that. All right. So the next thing that I'm going to do is put down the actual holidays this week. So Monday is Labor Day. So I'm just going to cover it where it says already Labor Day. And I'm just going to put that right there. I know it's kind of small. I don't know. The little stickers in this packet are really small. But then there's apparently Grandparents Day on Sunday. So I'm going to put that right here. And that's a reminder that we need to call Mateo's grandparents and tell them Happy Grandparents Day along with my actual grandparents as well. <laughs> and then on Sunday is our day for laundry at our house. So we can put the laundry sticker here. I'm going to write in laundry anyway, but I'll just, you know, put that sticker here because we're going to do laundry on Sunday. And then I do Mateo's laundry on Sundays and probably on Wednesday we'll do laundry. I do his laundry twice a week because he has quite a bit of stuff. Um, what else? What else? What else? On Monday I have a phone call that I have to do. Actually, you know what? I'm going to move these little laundry stickers for Mateo and put them on this side because I think I'm going to have this little area right here, the things that I have to do for my son. Um, Monday, I have a special phone call that I need to make, so I'm just going to kind of put that right here because I'll write that in the to-do box. And then on, let me think, on Saturday, I think I'm going to film a video for YouTube so I think I'm going to use this blue sticker as a, just a little reminder or a little bullet or something I'll put two stickers here because so I'm going to film um, let me see what else where else can I put my stuff um, the reminders are going to go here for next week so I'm going to just put in a few little dots here just so that it kind of marks it off. I am obsessed with these dots. I think they're like the most adorable thing. So I usually have no more than four reminders to carry on to the next week. So I'll just put four dots there. I think that looks super duper cute. And then I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to take these little flags because I don't really have anything else to flag off. And I'm just going to kind of do it. A design of some sort um, just in this silver just on the silver uh, heading or header rather because I just like these little flags I think they're super cute and putting stickers down make me happy I know that sounds loco but I kind of like how this is coming out so I'm glad that I did it yay um, I don't want the multicolor one too close together. So let's put a purple in there somewhere. And gray. Do that. And a purple one. That's actually coming out really nice. I like how that came out. It just looks celebratory, so that, that's kind of cute. Um, these little bars right here I could probably use. I don't want it to get too junky so I know some people like um, to fill all the white spaces in I personally don't so I'm just gonna leave that alone yeah I'm gonna do that all right so now I can actually go in and start filling out the things that I have to do each day um, the first thing that I can think of to fill out is this little box right here because my baby boy goes not uh, sorry what nine <laughs> My baby boy goes two months old, so Mateo is two months old. Ah, I 
can't believe time is flying by so fast. That's crazy. Um, and now I'm going to just take my little reminders that I've kind of stuck all over this desk and start to fill them in. And I'm just going to write chores in these little half boxes because that's just my heading. And I pretty much have, you know, things to do every single day because that's the life of a stay-at-home mom, you know, you take care of your home. And initially, because, you know, I always worked, it was kind of a big adjustment, but I am learning and actually enjoying taking care of my family and my house. I think um, one day if there was interest, I may actually do a video on being a stay-at-home mom and some tips and tricks, but we'll see. All right, so now I'm going to take my little reminders here and start to write in where they belong. <laughs> All right, so on Tuesday, or let's do Monday first. Monday, we're going to go to the farmer's market. Hopefully it is open because it is Labor Day. I need to call my, I have important phone calls, so I'm going to do that. Um, what else do I have to do on Monday? Um, it is a holiday, and we do have family coming over, so I'm going to put chill with family. If you watch my last Plan With Me video, you'll see that this is kind of done in a different way. Um, but sure, is, I really... I have a little bit of laundry to do, so I'm just going to write that in. And then I'm going to do a box right here with the word exercise because I need to be doing that. And then if I do exercise, I'll just tick the box. Yes, lovely. Yes. Okay. Um, so that's really all that I have to do on Monday for chores. I'm not going to do a lot because, you know, it is a holiday and I'm spending time with family. Um, on Tuesday... I need to clean out for chores. I would like to clean out fridge. But I also need to go to the post office. I need to go to the post office to mail off um, the giveaway that I, I did for my channel. Um, it's a Bath and Body Works giveaway. I'll just link that as well if you want to see the video. Unfortunately, it is closed or it will be closed by the time I upload this video, but um, I'll be doing more, so just stay tuned for that. The post office, I need to mail giveaways, and I have some cards that I need to send out. And cards. I also need to place a fresh direct order. That is how I get my groceries, so I'll place that order, and I need to work on um, Shutterfly prints. I pretty much am uploading my pictures to Shutterfly and printing them. Um, on Wednesday, I need to vacuum. What are you trying to say to me, little boy? What's going on? I need to vacuum. I need to mop and dust. <laughs> so that's quite a bit. And I also have Mateo's laundry. So that's a big, heavy chore day for me. Um, but, you know, it's all part of the territory. I'm also going to work on more Shutterfly stuff. I'm working on doing a book. On Monday, I need to upload a video. I forgot to write that in. So, upload video. Probably this one and the Plan With Me. So, I'll just put Plan With Me video. And... On Thursday, I'm going to wash Mateo's sheets. I like to wash his sheets and um, play mat and just anything that he plays on or touches. I like to rock. Um, rock. I like to wash. Even his rocker, it has little padding, and I like to wash that. I also like to document or just write down the days when I need to give Mateo a bath. So I'll probably do Tuesday. I tend to give him a bath every other day so I'll probably do it on his birthday and then Sunday on Sunday since I'm over here I'll just do that laundry vacuum mop I do a full-on cleaning on Sunday and my husband helps me with it as well so I do the whole house 
does um, I'm also gonna get my eyebrows done on Sunday just in time for the games of NFL yay with a smiley face um, on Friday I have to go to Target and as you can see I'm kind of just jumping all around um, that's usually how I plan that's quite frankly how I think these days um, and I'm just gonna go in now and just fill out the rest of my week and I'll probably just fast forward it so you can see it guys I've pretty much finished my entire spread um, you'll notice here on Thursday it's pretty much empty or blank and the reason that I did that is because anything that I don't finish and I this is just a tip anything that I don't finish for Monday Tuesday or Wednesday I will just you know put it onto Thursday I like to have one day not necessarily free but just available in case I need to um, catch up on chores or do any other errands and Saturday is pretty much my free day. I do whatever I want. It's a, you know, a rest day, except for, you know, film my video, which I do for leisure anyway, so I enjoy doing that. Um, so yeah, that's my spread. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. And if you have any questions, as always, leave comments below. If you enjoyed it, give me a thumbs up. Uh, please subscribe and have a great day. We want to thank you so much for watching. I decided to show you my son real quick since he was in the video as well. Say bye! Bye! Bye, guys.